Hi, today we're going to take a look at how to reset a, um, a Cisco Unified Communications 500 series platform back to factory defaults. Um, I highly recommend doing this in the CLI. Um, you're going to get, well, I know me personally, I've had some uh, major issues with getting a Cisco Configuration Assistant to reset to factory default. Um, you get any number of errors, it can be real pain. So um, doing it from the CLI is very easy if you know what to do. So um, I'm here logged into a Cisco uh, UC520. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is uh, connect to the service module. And you want to take it offline. Confirm. Once it's offline, you're going to do restore factory default. It's going to ask you if you want to confirm. Go ahead. And this will just take about a minute or two, or less. <laughs> the reload will take a while, so I'm going to go ahead and pause the recording while we wait. OK, and we're back. Um, that reset probably took about uh, 10, 10 to 15 minutes. Um, and you can see that I have my prompt back, so now I'm good to go. So now we have the, uh, we have reset the, uh, Unity Express module to um, factory default, so let's get out of there and go back to the CME um, uh, to to reset. So basically, once you get back to CME, um, just take a look at the flash and do a filter on CFG files, and you should have a factory config. And all we want to do is copy that to start up. and do a reload and that's it and you should have a uh, UC 500 back to factory default thanks for watching